And we start tonight with the sad end to a search on Lake Ontario. Good evening. I'm Mary Alice Demler. Crews spent the night looking for three kayakers who went out on the water despite high winds and waves. This morning in Orleans County, they found two of them alive. 21 year old Nathaniel McCormick and 19 year old Joseph Williams of Pennsylvania. But the third Nathaniel's twin brother Jacob died in the water. Two on your side, Joshua Robinson reports from the town of Carleton. After the first two of three lost kayakers were able to find their way to the shore of Lake Ontario, everyone held their breath as they hoped that the third kayaker would find the same route. Unfortunately, today we learned that was not the case. After the first call came through yesterday afternoon, Somerset Police Chief John Yotter says they joined other agencies, including the Coast Guard and Niagara County Sheriff's Department. After the first two kayakers came ashore near residences in Orleans County, Chief Thomas Johnson from Coast Guard Station Niagara says the body of the third kayaker was found by a Coast Guard boat. Kayaking is a popular sport on all the Great Lakes, and uh, it, it can be hazardous um, as well. So you need to make sure you're prepared for those type of voyages, uh, including filing a float plan with your family, having some means of communication, ensuring you're wearing uh, your life jacket. And if you're out past sunset, there's additional safety concerns that you should be aware of, including uh, having some type of signaling devices. Johnson confirmed all three were wearing life jackets, but says they're still investigating how it happened, as well as the cause of death for the third kayaker, and how much last night's rough weather played a part in the three men being separated from their kayaks, none of which have been recovered. As the investigation continues, Johnson says that any potential kayakers here on Lake Ontario or otherwise needs to consider their options for properly signaling for help, and that applies both on and off of your kayak should the need arise. For Channel 2 News, I'm Joshua Robinson.